Hello boys and girls, today we are going to make a mosaic. So here's my example here. You're going to have a packet of ideas to choose from. The more detailed you make it, like my butterfly, the harder it is going to be for you to do. So I suggest keeping it simple and only drawing one or two things. I would not do more than that, otherwise it's going to take you way too long. So I'm just going to draw a pumpkin. And I'm not going to take up the whole paper because I don't want it taking up the whole paper. So I can create my mosaic border around there. So I'm scratching my idea on here. And then you're going to transfer your sketch onto your final copy. Okay, so now I would take this and I would draw it on my final copy. I already have one started. So I'm going to show you on my started copy what we're going to do. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to need some black strips of paper and you are going to cut longer borders and glue it all around your outside. So you're going to cut smaller strips like this to glue all around the outside until you go all the way around all four sides. Once you have that done, then you're going to start outlining the smaller details. So you're going to need to cut smaller shapes so they should be like more like squares so I'm just gonna cut a bunch of these don't cut too many though but I'm just gonna cut up the small ones that I already cut you just don't want to cut up too much at once because then if we run out of time you have all these little squares cut up and they're just gonna go in the garbage because you're not gonna be reusing them next week because they're gonna fall out of your folders and make a mess so a trick to making this easier for you is you're going to take your white glue and you're going to draw a line on the paper with the glue and then you're just going to put these on top of that line leaving a little space in between draw another line because I used that all the way up already don't use too much glue and I'm just going to go all the way around filling in my mosaic you're going to do this to all of your pencil lines that you drew on here. If your pencil lines meet your border like they are here, you can overlap it a little and then move on to the next area. So now that you have it outlined, what you are going to do is you are going to take the colored strips that you want to use to color it in, and you're going to do the same thing. So you're going to cut them up into little bits, put your glue down on the paper, and then put the color strips on top of it. You can use more than one color if you want, but you're going to fill in the rest of this space now until you are done. Have fun, boys and girls.